And I'm convinced that half of the Brooks and Dunn records we sold were people reaching for the other Brooks. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the 2012 inductee into the Country Music Hall of Fame's Modern Era Artist category, Garth Brooks. This is a, it's a wonderful day, a day of joy, a day of honor. <clears throat> I still can't believe it. Um, it's, a, it's kind of a funny day because you mix it with a lot of um, humbleness, guilt um, for being here uh, among these names. I think everybody goes through this and the fact that you are excited, you feel very honored, and at the same time there's a, there's a bit of guilt or, um, I don't know what it is, a kind of embarrassment, um, so you feel uneasy, <clears throat> because I wouldn't be standing here today talking to you guys if it wasn't for Randy Travis. I wouldn't be standing here talking today if it wasn't for Ricky Skaggs, Keith Whitley, Steve Warner, uh, these guys, and, and guys, the list goes way, way back. Johnny Russell inducted me into the, hall, uh, into the uh, Opry. I'd love to see Johnny's name and very deserving to be here. And I think eventually they will get in. It's just uh, <clears throat> probably should have been before Garth Brooks came in. And that, that's the whole feeling of today. So it's a, it's a mix of emotion kind of things. Wait, we're going to do spouses next. Everybody over here to the left, Great job, dude. Nice staff. Yep. Very good. Can we need spouses next, please? Center, please. <laughs> a lot of times you go in the Hall of Fame at the end of your career, so uh, I'm, I, I got to make sure that I understand this honor, but now my job is to take this honor and take it somewhere that hopefully it hasn't been taken before, and that's to strap it on a rocket like a tour, especially a tour hopefully that's been, uh, you know, they've been vacant since 98. Yeah, I would love to fire one of our, our youngest is a sophomore in high school, so we'll see after that. It's, the kids are always the first priority. If they seem to be off and running well on their own, then uh, it sure would be fun to fire it up. One more this way, please. I know there are a handful of things that are the ultimate for him. Um, I know being a member of the Grand Ole Opry was one. I know being in the Songwriters Hall of Fame was one, and I know being in the Country Music Hall of Fame is one. He just, um, it's one of those things you, you dream about as an artist, and so I know what it means to him. And so I'm, I'm just really proud, proud for him and, and proud for the Hall of Fame. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2012 inductee in the Country Music Hall of Fame's Veterans Era Artist category, a lovely, Connie Smith. I had a great week. Uh, uh, I get to be here uh, with all my friends and peers, and uh, just uh, it's just a great honor. But I also just had my eighth grandbaby. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's hard to believe that it's really true. I'm excited, you know, for, uh, I've known it for just a little while and we weren't supposed to tell anybody about our media family and there's so many people I wanted to tell so bad. So, so I'm, I'm excited because I know it, they wanted me in here even more than I expected to be. So, so it's, it's, um, it's, it's, going, it, it's just the epitome of being in country music. Hargis, better known to pretty much all of us, as Pig Robbins. I am awfully uh, honored to uh, have been selected to go into the Country Music Hall of Fame uh, musician category this year. Once again, right here, please. Right here, Mr. Brooks, Brooke, this way. This way, Thank you. Are we going to put pigs in?